Hello guys! Welcome back to another episode of Space Chickens. As always, this is Jason, and we're up here on the space station at the moment. Uh, I've made some modifications. I made a bunch of these tin decorations blocks. I've made a bunch of stuff since we were last together, actually. Um, I went ahead and made uh, some more oxygen collectors, because I think I'm going to need more. I'm not certain if I will or not. Made this oxygen sealer, which is the thing that uh, will be used in conjunction with the airlock frames here, to hopefully make something that doesn't require this bubble. Um, which the bubble's fine. It's fine. It's just not as pretty as I want it. And as you can tell, I've made some changes here to the to the whole area. Um, I've modified this a little bit by adding another hopper and a chest. So we can see up here, we got a chest, and I brought a bunch of wood up with me so I could fill that in the chest. Um, so for right now, that's as automated as it's going to get. Um, so the next thing here is, let's go ahead and close this area up so we can test, I can test the sealer here. So the sealer's meant to work in an area about like this. Let's get rid of that. Okay. Alright. So we got the frames here. We may lose some stuff here. I don't know if there's... Okay, there is cobble down there. I don't think these need to be powered or anything. I'm not 100% certain about that, though. In fact, let's look at the side of one of them here. No, they don't look like they, they would take power in any way. Uh, let's go ahead and get rid of that. Hmm, made a noise. I don't know if that's exactly what we're going for. Now, as I understand it, we need eight of these to, f to seal up an area. So, technically, that should be an airlock now. So, I wonder, now I don't know how the sealer works. I'm assuming it works the same as the bubble distributor here, though. So, let's go ahead and break the bubble distributor. Me that. So our bubble should just be instantly gone now, right? Well, I'm assuming it's gone. So let's place this uh, sealer here. And I made two while I was at it, just figured why not. Okay, I've got a problem here. Okay. Now, technically, enabled seal. Status on seal, oxygen input. All right, so let's see. Let's see what happens here. Let's let it get full on oxygen and see. Status unsealed. I don't know if it has to reach 100%. I don't think it can reach 100% because I don't think we have enough oxygen on the other side to provide it with 100%. Yeah, I think we're going to cap out here pretty soon. The status unsealed makes me think that <laughs> it is not... Yeah, I think that's as much as this is going to get. Yeah, status unsealed. Now, that, the question is why. I don't know the answer to that. It made a noise that one time when I placed one of them, but I don't know why I did that. Status unsealed. Has the color of that changed? Or is that just my head? Yeah, it's not... It's not working, and I don't know why. Huh. Well... Hmm. I wish... I had more info. <laughs> like right through there would technically be unsealed, but I don't I don't think the machines and stuff are gonna get in the way. That's why I put that block there before I place this. Huh. Okay. Well, that did not work. 
So now my question is, let's put the bubble back while we're, we're contemplating life. Get our bubble back. Alright, so now let's, uh, let's test this thing. Let's just make a little cube out here. I'm assuming since, the reason why I made a whole bunch more of these 10 decoration blocks is because I assumed that, I didn't know what can and can't be sealed. So I assume that that uh, these were the things to go with. You know what I mean? Um, all right. So let's go with just a little small box here. And just test it. Just see what happens. Okay. Bubble smaller? Oh no, bubble's about the same. Did I? Okay, got that all loaded. Um, so let's put this out here. Right there will be fine. Um, let's do the. There's the sealers at right there. Okay. So the sealers works the same as the other guy. So we got power and oxygen. Here's the power. And here's the oxygen. And I should have some extra of these as well, actually. Yep, there's the sealable copper and the sealable oxygen pipes. So we'll go ahead and replace those. I don't know why this. I'm, I'm I'm mainly testing to see if these machines are kind of messing it up here, um, because that's really the only thing that's going to make this room any different than that that room. Okay, so now we need an oxygen collector out here. Um, let's see here. Let's uh, go ahead and run some copper pipe to copper wire. I mean. That I don't know where the power goes in on this guy. Is blue power? Yeah. Okay, so that's where we wanted to sit. Okay. Um, and let's just, uh, crap, I don't think I have any leaves. Okay, we do. Good, 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 good. This is all just for testing purposes here, um, really. Just because I want to see how this all works. That. Let's go ahead and get the... the charcoal engine run in here. I feel like you should be generating right now. Yeah, because we got this guy right here. Oh, okay. It needed, it needed at least one pair of leaves. Ooh. <laughs> and every time I jump on the, on the space station, it freaks me out. And I don't know, maybe I have to get up to 100% here. I don't really know. Let's click on it. Yeah, see, that's not... We don't have a lot here. I don't know what kind of range this thing has as far as how way the leaves actually give it oxygen and whatnot. Just gonna use all 
all my leaves here. Oh my god. Okay. Now then, let's go in here. Maple seal. Okay, so we ain't got enough power yet. That's fine there. Ooh, it's dark in here. Crap, I don't have any glowstone either. Okay, so we should be getting enough power here pretty soon, I would think. Gotta do a let's leave that open there actually <clears throat> so we can check it. So this guy's got 64% oxygen in. What's the uh, oxygen collector getting? Because I'm almost out of leaves out here, honestly. Yeah, it's only. 7% output. Let's see, okay, so we're still unsealed. So if I make it all dark in here again. Sealed! Okay, 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 okay. Okay, we've done it. We've sealed. Okay, we're gonna unseal again there. Because I want to grab these. see how they work. Let's close that up and let's close this back up as well. Okay, so the that room should be sealed again. Let's open it up here. Uh, actually, like this. Uh, bam, bam. And I might have to make it a complete square. It might not be like uh, the ender chat or uh, ender portal is. Not ender portal. You know what I mean? Yeah. See, unsealed. So how do I? I don't know how these things work. You guys need to need to act right. Yeah, it can't take power. I don't think it could, but. We're checking. So if we disable the seal and enable the seal again, now it seems like it updates pretty much automatically. Like, yep, now we're sealed again. Huh. Well, crap, man! How is this thing supposed to work? Yep, unsealed. Hmm. Maybe, maybe it needs power. Like, not. I made a lever, by the way. Oh! Oh, crap! Oh, yeah! Yeah, we're sealed now! Okay. Okay. So, what happens? What happens whenever... Now we're sealed. Okay. Huh. Cool. I did not expect it to work like that, actually. I thought it was like... Like a bubble thing that you could just walk through. So do I lose my oxygen in here when I open that? Like, how does this thing work? And am I using... I wonder how much power I'm using. Let's make another, another lever here. We have to do something with pressure plates or something, I guess. So that room is sealed up now. So let's... Uh, whee. Yeah, see, that thing's still going to be active and sucking as hard as it can. So we're still going to be going through coal the same rate. I guess the only difference is when I open this and it's unsealed, does the Chocobo start taking damage that's in here? Because, again, we're doing this whole thing so that we can have space chickens. The bubble might just be better. That or I'm going to have to make an airlock system so that... 
we have two sets of these we go into an area that doesn't have any oxygen and we open well it's still gonna be unsealed there for a moment so it's really the same isn't it yeah I guess it is huh well, this is all very interesting Um, but, all that said, I made us some stuff. You notice these potions here in my inventory. Um, I was thinking about, uh, I spent quite a while mining stuff and everything in between episodes here. And I guess I forgot some of it on the surface, because I don't see it anywhere. Yep. Yep, I forgot some stuff on the surface. I'm going to have to run back to the surface here and grab some stuff. Um, and then I'll see you guys on the moon, I guess, here in a minute. Alrighty, guys, we're back here on the moon. Got to take our little buggy here for a spin. You guys said the wheels were spinning the wrong direction yesterday. They look like they're spinning the right way to me. Thing's still a buggy. The buggiest buggy you've ever seen. Put a buggy in your buggy because it's so buggy. Buggy! Okay, I'll stop saying the word buggy now. Alright, so we're going to do something here on the moon. Not just any old thing. We're going to ride this derpy-ass buggy over here. And we're going to try something. We're going to do it right over here by all these villagers. Because they are bound to help and protect. Serve and protect, villagers! Serve and protect! Okay, let's park it right here. Hey guys, I know you guys are all alien to my to my planet and all, but I want to show you guys something. You ready? Y'all ready? Okay. I, I expect some help with this matter now. How hard can this be? Oh, good God. <laughs> so my first question is, is this guy going to take oxygen lacking damage? Oh, he mad. He mad already. Let's see if he takes damage. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at him. Look at him. He's suffocating. I think. I think he's suffocating. Yeah, look at him. He can't breathe. You should breathe, bro. Why don't you breathe? I don't see his little bar going down. Hey, God, don't look at me. It's kind of hard to hit me on space, huh? I should probably drink this. Don't get too high. Oh, damn. He done withered me. You know what I didn't do? I should have done it. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I regret this. Stop. Stop for a second. Stop. 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 Crap. 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 Get me in this building. Crap, man. Don't look at me. Don't look at me for a second. I gotta, I gotta think about what I've done. So, I did not, I did not think to put my spaceship somewhere that I could get to it from, from Earth, and I don't have, I don't have a, uh, a backup spaceship anymore. So, let's, uh, let's actually go do that, just in case, just in case I do die. Man, he's way over here. He's so mad. Oh, this asshole. He's tracking me. I should have thought about this a little bit better before I did this. I don't want to chase... I don't want him to chase me all the way... All the way over... <laughs> over to our, our... Our rocket ship, man. Okay, we're just gonna go. Is he still tracking me? Find somebody else to track, guy. He's still tracking me. What an asshole. I can't see anything anymore. Oh, yeah, 
here, look at this asshole. Oh, he just fucking withered me. What a dick. I got witch regeneration again. Okay. Okay, this was a terrible idea. The worst of ideas. I thought he would suffocate. He does not. And he tracks me. Do they, they regenerate off, off of the wither damage, don't they? I think they do. That wither lasts quite a while. I, I wish I just wish I had put put my spaceship into a chest. With him chasing me like this, though, I can't do it. Can't do it. I just gotta gotta fight him like a man. A scared man. Very scared man. I gotta fight him like a very scared man. Which is fine. I can do this. I can do this. I have I have the strength and the fortitude. Do this. Fuck me. I'm not. I can't do this. I can't do this. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it, guys. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. So, so dead. So dead. So, so fucking screwed. I'm so screwed. So screwed. Okay. So. Crap. I have to make another rocket ship. I don't have another rocket ship. Crap! I'm pretty sure I don't have another rocket ship. If I have one, it's up here in Wilson's butt, but I'm pretty sure I don't have one. <sighs> Dang it, man! So stupid of me! So stupid of me. Well, now there's a wither on the moon. Yeah, I don't have another one. Crap! Damn, I slammed my mouth so good I got on you. Okay. Well, crap. <laughs> All right, I gotta make another rocket, guys. Fuck. <sighs> crap. I have most of what I need. Luckily, I believe. I think but that all said I think I'm gonna call this episode good here for today guys I appreciate everyone watching as always um, the lesson we've learned today is don't assume that a withers gonna suffocate because they're not and I assumed that the wither was gonna suffocate and it was gonna be easy mode and so I was like oh yeah I can do this hey, I'm not even worried Woo! nope I gotta find some melons man because I was like, oh, I'll just make some instant health potions and stuff. And I ain't got no melon. Got to have melon to make instant health potions, man. So uh, maybe I could find some uh, a melon somewhere in my journeys. That would be nice. Oh, yeah, you guys, you all synchronized and singing me a song. Pretty beautiful song about not having a rocket and being fucked in the butt by a wither. Well, I appreciate you guys watching as always, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.